Hello everybody and welcome back to Planet Crafter. So I have been reading through some comments and people have been giving some very helpful information. Uh, first off, uh, from Grandma Jean, uh, who has really been helping a lot out with a lot of videos. She informed me that this tree spreader right here, uh, well, you need to actually have it going up on shore because as she pointed out, uh, trees can't grow in water. So I'm gonna, gonna fix that right here. So we want it as close as possible to the shoreline. Right, right about there. Now we'll put this in here. So hopefully we get some trees growing pretty soon. Fingers crossed that works. So thank you, Grandma Jean, for that. And then I had another commenter point out, uh, David Ferguson, that maybe it'd be a good idea to put a tier two extractor down on the uh, super alloy area. And I could not agree more. So let's go ahead and get the materials for that. So for that, we need super alloy rod, two iridium rods, and three osmium. We got a lot too. Just grab them all for now. Oh, we did not need to grab them all, but that's okay. Totally forgot the aluminum. Ooh, no, don't, don't. Don't drop those, those are important. Okay, there we go, grab one of those. Head back over here, do that. Okay, we'll put the rest of the super alloy up and get our two iridium rods and our three osmium perfect okay and i do believe we have quite a lot of power on our hands so now we're gonna grab these all right so tons of food tons of food which is good Let's see, put some of this stuff up. All right, go ahead and eat that one, throw those in there. And I think the super alloy area, yes, it already has some storage containers over there. Go ahead and drink one of those, but I'll grab some more iron and we will head over there. Okay, so we're here at the super alloy area I'm gonna put this here because it's gonna be useful I don't have anything crazy in there yet but we will go in here and slap this thing down right here perfect so that's gonna be great getting a super alloy great I'm gonna go up here and just grab all this stuff out of here it'll be useful to have Okay, let's see. Let's just jetpack around a little bit and uh, explore this area. I haven't been here in a while. Ooh, nice. We can go down in there. And also, chest. Wheat. Right, let's go down in here and see what we find. Oh, just some storage. Oh, okay. This is some good stuff. Wow. All right, well, we'll be back here. Hopefully I can launch myself back up here. I can, haha. -ha. All right, well, we're gonna store this stuff and then go back and raid the rest of that area. Okay. Putting that stuff in there, putting this stuff in there. All right, let's head back. Okay, grab that, oh, grab this, grab all that. Oh. Okay, well, there was a hidden thing. I will do whatever it takes to quit this planet. I had to dig deep to find the resources needed to build a launch platform. The storms have been less frequent lately. 
I need to find a big meteor crater and build the platform at the bottom of it in order to be protected from the winds. The magnetic fields on this planet are completely crazy. It's the first time in my life I have seen anything like this. Once again, I'll leave this shelter, hoping I'll be able to make it. Well, I hope they did. Because they left me all their stuff. Alright. I hope you made it out of here, fellow survivor. Okay. Go back up here. Deposit all that stuff back in there. And then we will... Go and, um, yeah, do some more exploring. Then we'll come back and grab the, uh, super alloy and the other good stuff. And, uh, just ferry it back. Yeah, we haven't really touched this area much at all yet. So, um, yeah. About time that we should do that. Oh, you want me to actually go when you're near? Alright. Great. Let's see, do we have any super alloy? Nope, not yet. Ooh, hold on. I saw something in here. Found a hidden uranium cave. Okay. This is much closer. Well, let's see if there's a uh, chest in here or something. There is. Great. We will take all this stuff back. Now we will head back before we run out of oxygen. Got very bright and orange out here. Ooh, we got the incubator. Nice. So now we can use that to incubate that larva that we found. All right, we made it back safely. Okay, just add these. We'll put some good stuff in this one too. This is probably enough to take back some good stuff. I'll go grab any super alloy that are in here. Well, really anything. Oh, we got one. That is good. Okay, so we want to throw that stuff in there. We want all those. We'll take that, those, those, those. See you. Stay hydrated, everybody. Okay. Anything in this one? Oh, yeah, all these. Probably don't need those yet. Take all those. Yep, sounds good to me. Let's head back. I know there's a uranium cave that close. I need to uh, move our extractor or something like that. Because the other one's like so far away. And we're back. Okay, I'm gonna put down these things, and then I want to figure out some stuff. Oh, we are completely full on those. Okay. Great. Those in there. We will put this one in here. We'll put this one in here too. Okay. We're doing. Fertilizer. There we go. There we go. Okay, what do we need for an incubator? We need tree bark, fertilizer, tier 2, super alloy, and O2. Okay. Take this, this. Let's say super alloy. Great. We just came back with some. Perfect. I think we should put this in. Hmm. Should we put it in here? I think we're going to need some more storage in here as well. So I think I'll put it in here. Put it right. Put it right. There we go. Look at that. Okay. 
Okay. I don't exactly know what we put in there. I know the larva. Probably a mutagen. But then what else? Oh, I should just check the blueprints. Okay. Great. Okay. Uh, so a fertilizer. Okay. Great. Fertilizer. There we go. Do, do, do. Research. Okay, now we're gonna let that go. Oh, right. I could have just checked this the whole time. Well, that is good to know. We did it. <laughs> okay, let's make some fun ones. Okay, so we need these, this one, a mutagen. Here we go. Do, do, do. Research. All right. It took us a while, but now we're actually using them. Look at those. Nice. Okay. Uh, now what do we do with them? Is it like an insect spreader type thing? Butterfly dome. Okay, well we're doing stuff slightly ahead of time, but that is A-OK. -okay. Great. Because we have that stuff up and running, so we can get all the stuff done at some point when we need it. Awesome. Okay. What now? Eat us that. Drink some water in a second. Let's see. Okay, we really need to increase some of this stuff. Biomass, plants. Slowly getting there. Oh, let's check our tree spitter. Oh, we're growing trees. Let's go. Oh, this is awesome. I want to make so many more of these and just line this whole area. This is excellent. Oh man, so exciting. Okay, uh, I want to do another one. Okay, let's do it. Oh, this is excellent. All right, super alloy, right? need tier one fertilizer right this tier one yep bacteria sample I think it's algae and water I believe yep algae and then we'll go outside and grab some water there we go all right, we will make that. There we go. Then we also need cheap bark and a bioplastic nugget. Perfect. Okay, these are done. Yep. Okay, is this tree being? Oh, it's close. It's close. We will just chill in here while that gets done. All right, excellent. Just going away for a second. Nice. And now that we know how to kind of do it, it's going to be awesome. Great. Let's make a new tree spreader. Uh, there, I'll do it. Great. So it's increasing our O2 and plants. Excellent. These look like those trees over there in the beach area. Well, this is fun. 
I like this a lot. What other blueprints do we unlock? Anything super fun? Auto crafter. The yep, we've just got the tier four. Tier four. And all the stuff like that that's producing huge amounts of stuff. Yeah, that's that is definitely better, but it requires to be on water. Then I hit the research button. I guess I didn't. That's annoying. But it's fine. Okay. Excellent. Just grabbing the stuff out of here. Let them go on for a little too long. Because I'm going to need those now. What to do? What to do? Okay. We could go explore some more lava area stuff. These numbers... I need to increase the pressure more. Because that's not really doing much. I can do another machine optimizer. And I can put it near the pressure stuff. Did I already do that? Okay. I'll put another... Tier 4 pressure. Tier 4 drill. And then we will put... Oh, those trees are coming in. Let's go. Tier 4 drill. A lot of super and some osmium. Great. Now we need a... Machine optimizer. Okay. Grab this. We're going to do... Oh, plants multiplier. Hmm. Okay. But we want the pressure to put in there. So we need that, two explosive powder, two iron, and a cobalt. Right? Yep. Two explosive powder. I do believe I have that. Yep. Just need a singular iron. Oh, we just got the tier two machine optimizer. Okay, well, what do we need for that? Obsidian. All right, forget the iron, we're doing the obsidian. That back in there. That back in here. So obsidian. We didn't use all that, did we? On this next. Down this um. eight machine capacity. Okay. Two, three, four, five, and it's got a couple of those in there. But we could put more pressure things in here. We're learning. Let's probably break down those smaller tier ones over there so we could just focus on the tier fours. I will do that in a second. Was it done? Oh, yeah, grabbing the pressures. Pressure and pressure. Nice. Now we're going to be boosting those numbers. I did not think it would be this effective this early. Do, do. Let's go. 250, 250, 250. Excellent. So we're going to go over here. We're going to break these down. Now we just need more tier four drills. We uh, need three more. All right, here comes the power drain. Get all of these. I'm gonna go check our numbers now. 
Remember everybody, stay hydrated. These nice little trees, they're so cute. We're getting bugs. All on the inside the base. Okay. So real quick, does anybody know if like larva are attracted to specific things and is there an easier to way to get higher level uh larva, like uncommon or rare or something like that? I did just pick up common and an uncommon. I want to make some bees. Silkworms be good too. I think bees are going to be real nice. Okay. Yeah, I want to make some bees. We will do that. Here and here. We don't have a tree. We do have a tree in here. Okay, excellent. Probably going to do another tree spreader probably a few honestly their power looking like excellent oh yeah what's our pressure whoa that went up a lot nice how many pressure rockets do I have I don't think enough right Let's see pressure we've only got three uh, I think we need to increase O2 and plants as well. But let us check. We get O2. Yeah, we need to increase that by a lot. Uh, pressure increased by a good amount. Uh, heat's done. Don't need to worry about that. But biomass. So, okay. So, need to do more pressure need more oxygen and need more plants all right i know we're gonna need this rocket anything else i don't know okay pressure is two supers and three silicones yeah we've already gone through a whole bunch of that um super alloy already oh a bug Nice. More up here. All right, let's go. Three, two, one, launch. And there it goes. Excellent. Oh, above. Another common one. Is, uh... They're kind of hard to spot. It's like, oh, is that just like a sliver of rock? Nope, that is a larva. Okay, just running around here, you know, doing some bug collecting while uh, the sky rains down upon me. That's okay. That one felt really close. Maybe I should get inside. Maybe I should. Okay, super dark. I mean, by dark, I mean very bright. All right. Let's see. Those are still coming along pretty good. Ooh, nice. We finished our bees. Excellent. There we go. Did we put in a new tree? No, we didn't. But that's okay. Great, 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 great. Let's see. Power's good enough. I'll say we finish breaking down these. Everything up. All right. Those have been taken out. What do we need for another heater? Might as well, right? Not a lot of stuff, but some stuff we don't have. And that's all right. We will just go get more. And silicone. There we go. 
We'll put this one down here. Probably not a lot. We're just going to run over there and come right back. Oh no, it's hitting all of our stuff. I'm glad those can't break things that are settled on the ground. That would be very, very annoying. All right, do you have any more super alloy? We do. Great. Gonna go in here and grab some more stuff that we left behind. Uh, let's see. Do, do. Well, let's put back and we'll grab the pulsar quartz. Excellent. Whoa. Look how everything turned kind of greenish and everything. Whoa, what are these? Oh my god, they're going everywhere. Oh, they're super. Oh no. I need these. Quick, quick, put all the crap away and grab the super alloy. I need them. My super alloy is being rained down upon this giant area. Praise be the sky deities that are raining down the glorious super alloy for me and my endeavors. Thank you. There's so much. Please, I need it. I need it all. Just don't kill me with it, but... Alright, so here's a question for everybody. Uh, for I do not know the answer. Is there like a percentage chance of that happening where it's raining down super alloy? Because that seems very low chance. If anybody kind of knows like if how I can trigger that again or something like that, just let me know. Or if it's just something that happens in the world or I mean, I don't know. Just just let me know. I want to I want that to happen again. Oh, we got a, the beehive now. Let's go. That's so much super alloy. We found like, uh, I don't know, like two full inventories of stuff. And there's still more out there. I even found a, a larva while I was running around. All right. Well, I'm just going to go ahead and take this stuff back. Well, hold on. Let me uh, eat this here bean and then we'll get another one of those. Let's go. So yeah, if y'all know a way to make that happen again, let me know. Um, if you also know of how I can get more uncommon or rare larva, let me know that as well. Like, is there like a special place that they spawn or something? Uh, yeah, who knows? Because I did find one just inside the base. That was nice. Um, so yeah, looks like I'm, I can put more tree uh, spreaders over here. I think I'm gonna try and bunch them up a little bit and then do a. Uh, optimizer or something really i just have o2 ones and some heat ones but we're done with heat right yeah, we're done with heat but that does not mean i shouldn't bump it up because it'll help us uh really pump up these numbers okay let's put down all of our vast amounts of super alloy now this is a good problem to have. Ooh, and a water filter. All right, what do we need for a water filter? That just means I can just drink from the surrounding area, like just lakes and stuff, right? Yeah, water filter. Aluminum, silicone, fabric, nuggets, water. Great, give me that. Oh. Now I see what uh, the commoner, I believe it was David Ferguson, was saying. Still running around with a tier two and year two three. Sorry, I thought I already had that. Well, let's see. Super alloy rod, two osmium, and uranium rod. Don't worry, I've got the tier three now. We're good. We are good. Okay. I need, I just unlocked something. The beehive, which was great. And then the waterfall, right. What I got. And I got both of those. Yep. Great. A beehive. Increase plants and insects. Okay. 
bee larva, super alloy, fertilizer, bioplastic nugget. Ooh, we need to make a fertilizer. All right, where do we put our beehive at? Here. But it crafts honey. Okay. Don't know what. Oh, look at them. Wow. Maybe I should put them over there. I should put them near the flowers. Because this will be perfect for them. Look at that. See, now they have flowers to pollinate. Awesome. This is great. Ooh, new blueprint. Tree seed cernia. How do we make that? Cernia. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll see. They get better as we go along. Okay. Awesome. I should go harvest some algae. I haven't done that in a while. And uh, we're quickly going to need all of them. So that's not this thing. Yeah, we could just drink. Nice. That's awesome. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of algae. That's okay. Oh, I need to go grab the methane that's out there. Whoops. Methane. All right, there we go. Great. Oh, this is so exciting. Oh, look at that. We're almost at insects. Excellent. Excellent. Don't want to pump up those numbers. What do we got? Okay. I do believe we need some more O2, but let me check. Yep. We need O2. We need pressure. And we need plants just got that with the insects some high quality food going on yeah look at this we can really get up in there okay butterfly larva we just need more plants we do have plant spreader rockets available yeah but is O2 more important Yes, I believe so. Yep. Let's do the tree or the O2 one. Let's see. Lance rocket. Don't need that yet. Well, I mean, we do, but not yet. Okay. Let's do a seed spreader rocket. To increase the O2. Rocket engine, super alloys, bacteria, mutagen tree bark. Okay. I believe two super alloys all we needed. Yep, there we go. Three, two, one, launch. There it goes, everybody. Do we have any honey? We do! I bet you that's needed for something big down the line. Put that in the food one. Great. How are we at? Oh, we're almost at insects. We can just watch it happen. Slowly. Slowly. there
Patience. And we did it! Yay! We made it to insects. It's the first. That's the furthest I've made in the terraformation stage. Hey, fella, this one's just flying by. This is great. Breathable atmosphere next. Well, now I'm really excited. Wow. Okay. This is great. Okay. So yeah. I think I'm going to end that episode here for today. We were very productive. And there's just so much happening. And it's great. So yeah. Thanks for watching everybody. Be sure to like and subscribe. Continue to drop the comments down below. Because they're very insightful. And very helpful. Uh, I like reading them. Seeing what y'all have to say and everything. Love the feedback. And uh, yeah. So bye everybody. Oh. Before we say bye everybody. We just got a new message. Perfect timing. Who's it from? Sentinel Core. Our sensors detected that the conditions on your planet should allow the uh, uh, apparition of wild larvae in the on surface. Use those larvae in the incubator to breed endemic species of bees and butterflies. Those species are required to fulfill your mission and increase the speed of your terraformation process. You are closely watched. Let us remind you that you shouldn't use communication devices to contact anyone else but Sentinel Core. Spooky. Here's the other message. Messages that we found. So yeah. So now, again, thanks everybody for watching, and bye everybody.